Hi, I'm Emily. Hi, I'm Alan. Alan, are you growing asparagus this year? I really want to make an asparagus pasta dish I saw on Pinterest the other day, but the ones at the store didn't look too good. Yeah, of course I am. On Pinterest, huh? Yeah. Pinterest is an online pin board where you can share or pin things you find while browsing the internet. You can follow other users and view their pins, too, or upload your own pins. The basic premise is sharing and curating the content of the web. Each pin links back to its original source, and the visuals on Pinterest make for a quick, engaging experience. Let's face it, recipes are a lot more appealing when you see the pictures rather than see the text. But moving beyond food, uh, Pinterest is also being used in the classroom. One project idea might be for every student in your class to create a pin board to share with other users. Students can collect images related to a specific subject and organize them using Pinterest. Sure. Well, in a history course, each student could take a different decade and pin images to fit that decade. Their pin board could tell a story of events of the decade. There's a commenting feature, too, in, with each pin, so discussion is encouraged. So now that you're convinced, let's talk about how to get started. Pinterest is connected to either your Facebook or Twitter accounts. You're automatically set up to follow your Facebook or Twitter contacts when you join. You can install a Pin It browser add-on. Then whenever you find something you want to pin, just click the Pin It button and it will automatically be added to your pin board. You can create different pin boards too, perhaps one for class, one for home. Repins are sharing a pin you find from another user to one of your own boards, thus sharing it with your own followers. Beyond using Pinterest with your students, you can also follow other instructors. There's an entire category dedicated to education, so you might find some cool teaching ideas. You can follow us on Pinterest, E. McWorthy and Fred and Charlie. Uh, we are new to the scene, though, so some of my boards might be a bit empty. Thanks for watching.